student should either be retried or set free. A ruling this week has thrown out the conviction in the murder of Jill Beerman, a murder that was 19 years ago. And new this morning, Nina Scolo explains how the judge's decision has reopened wounds for the victim's family. Nina. Absolutely, Drew. The ruling overturns the conviction of John Myers II and orders his release from state prison within 120 days unless prosecutors decide to retry him. He is currently serving a 65-year prison sentence in the death of IU student Jill Bierman. Bierman disappeared in May of 2000 while riding her bike near Bloomington. After years of searching, her remains were found in 2003 in a Morgan County field. Medical examiners determined Bierman died of a gunshot wound to the back of her head. Then in 2006, a jury convicted Myers for the murder. Tuesday, a federal judge tossed out the conviction, ruling Myers failed to receive effective assistance of counsel during trial. The ruling also said Myers' due process rights were violated when false evidence was presented to the jury and when state prosecutors failed to disclose all exculpatory excuse me, evidence. The 147-page ruling also lists details where evidence was incorrect or not presented to the jury. Overnight, Jill Bierman's mother, Marilyn, released a statement over Facebook. It was Marilyn's birthday Tuesday. She writes, many of you are aware this became a bittersweet day with the news that the conviction of Jill's murderer was overturned. Next steps are to be determined, and I will take all of this one day at a time. The Morgan County prosecutor was the prosecutor in the case, and he issued a statement that reads in part, needless to say, we are all disappointed with this outcome as believed that after 13 years, the jury's guilty verdict was final. I have spoken with the Indiana Attorney General's office, and they are just analyzing the opinion and its ramifications. Thus, it is premature to discuss the next step in the case. Myers' defense attorney also released a statement saying he's pleased the order will give Myers and his family renewed hope. Now, prosecutors have 120 days to make a decision about moving forward with a retrial. We'll make sure to keep you updated on the case here on Wish TV and WishTV.com. Nina, thank you. The